Uh, hello, today is my birthday, so I would like to thanks to all the friends who gave me a lot of love during the past one year. I just thinking what is the meaning and how many years I have been uh, share my story with my all the friends, especially in the Facebook. And also I'm reviewing what and how I came and where the universe also has been uh, changed so many uh, different uh, shapes now. So I just watch uh, my time when I was born someday before. <laughs> I didn't want to say what exact date but anyway this is what I imagined that I had the shape like this. So right now the uh, the eggs and sperms uh, finally they create some very small like molecules and they they generate all their organs and looks like a something animal. I don't believe I have this shape. I couldn't say this is me. Of course this is not me, but anyway similar shape I believe. And finally, beautiful baby came out. She is not me actually, but anyway, I hope I was so cute like this. So how come we have this kind of uh, uh, revolutionary things from the single cells to such a big shape and now more than several decades I grew up like this. Sorry, I have uh, too many stuff on my desk. Anyway, uh, this is something reminding me uh, what happens during past several decades where I was born and I have been enjoying my life together with this universe. To find my origin, I just uh, watch what Bible has been mentioning about the birth. Eventually, the very first ancestor, Adam and Eve, unfortunately falls they violate the rules that God asked them to keep not to touch the apple and finally they ate and that's the first digester maybe not the first but most serious digester I don't know why the uh, Noah also has the same digester so all the history become so sad right now anyway this is the first Garden of Eden we have they expelled it from this uh, apple, I mean Eden, and finally we have history like this. This is the kind of models which Bible said. I think this is something philosophical meaning which we remind. That's why I'm only thinking that there is a mission and obligation that human has to do in this planet. So eventually I review, uh, because I, I am anyway an uh, engineer, I study all the science and I believe science never telling a lie. Th there is a evidence, there is a reason, so we, we have to listen what story we find in the, in the universe. The Big Bang Theory, they just say within just less than one second everything was determined and created and they, they make a whole uh, shape of the universe and they expand now it's flying away from from what they happen in during just one second less than one second on this uh, time and then now still we we the scientists find the universe is still expanding the velocity expanding speed is never decaying it's uh, still acceleration so to solve this equation, they think their energy is, is pushing this away, not by the mass inertia load to expand. So the, the universe still creation period is, is still growing. And then we are thinking why this happened and what happens there. In the Bible, they say the God made in a second, just to say something. Science, uh, scientists said anyway, the, the, we have a huge, uh, for example, we have a certain billion of history of time of the universe creation. Anyway, this time, the time, time we are uh, mentioning, time is after Einstein, we know this is relative. Somebody time is infinite, somebody time is very short. So now the scale of time in this planet with the speed of human, we can say certain billion, but 
you know, Bible time, we don't know. So I don't want to argue about time, whether God made one time, whether Big Bang made one time. But in interesting thing is, all universe, every organ, every animal, every uh, science is well organized. So it looks like a random and chaotic, but it's not true. It's well organized to rule everything following the science. So the entropy zero status means somebody has to organize. The, that means there is a, some willing and intention and love and they, they make something. This is very important. Even we have a Big Bang, which is showing that Big Bang and explosion, but they are mentioning that there is a story, there is a well-organized way of Big Bang. It's not random, it's not chaotic. There is a something governed the rule. That's why such a beautiful world is made, which is uh, entropy zero, which cannot be made by the random. This is made by something, maybe Buddha, maybe Jesus, I don't know, but something scientifically made. So when I review my, uh, my bone and how I grow, uh, so I, I just check how scientists uh, research the, the growing of the universe, and especially for the Earth. They said about uh, 13.7 billion years ago, the, the Earth has to start growing and created. Interesting thing here is the earth, the animal, I mean the, the bio things is came out from maybe about 4 billion years ago. So 13 uh, billions and 4 billions we have uh, bio, biological things happening. And the human is much less than this, about uh, uh, 30, 300, uh, 3 million years, yeah, 3.2 million years ago, we find the symptom that the, the human-like people coming out. And we don't know exactly this is same or not, but very similar. The, the biologically, they said this is human. They, so we say first human beings came out from about 300, 3 million years ago. But in the Bible, everything says 6,000 years. But if you look at carefully, we have an uh, ice age. About uh, uh, 10,000 years ago, we have an uh, ice age. And after that, we have uh, some, uh, some historical things happen, which is called some bronze uh, era. That times every people trying to get their personal ownings. That's the starting point of fighting of human races, I believe, to get more rich things there. So the, the time here, uh, after uh, Ice Age, we have a uh, history of Bibles. This is mm, about several thousand years difference, but actually it's, it's not, not very meaningful because everything was written here very old time. So I don't want to uh, detail argue about this, but I want to have uh, some, some flow or direction that we can understand how we can talk about this. So this is uh, Noah's Ark, and Israel starts from uh, 4,000 years ago, and Jesus Christ from 2,000 years ago. Now we are talking about first revolution, first generation uh, revolution is happening. So too many things happening. We, we don't know what happened today, and then nobody expects after 10 years what will be really happening that time. This is a kind of technology eruptions here. So the, the 6,000 years of human history described in the Bible, I think, has uh, some, some story about the mind of God. I'm, I'm trying to read the Bible because I just uh, get so many uh, knowledge and um, I'm just thinking there is a superpower who is ruling the, the universe. Actually, the ruling rule is science, but basically the, the fundamental part of science is it's based on the love, based on to, to make a good direction, to give them more pressure. So what I believe is the universe designed with the love. Uh, it can find all the things. That, that's why I was thinking the Bible story and science, uh, the fundamental is a parallel. So I have no objection to following the Bible story. 
So this is uh, the ice age. We have uh, several times of ice age, and the last ice age we had is about 10,000 years ago. All these kind of animals, uh, mammals, everything has disappeared, and still human, human survived because the ice age doesn't mean really frozen. Ice age is uh, some kind of a uh, big uh, cold time, and the uh, human. Human survived here. The time, the temperature different. Average temperature in the global is only uh, plus minus five degrees something like that. Anyway, that time, the the whole the uh, the the history of a uh, composition of CO2 showing the temperature of the Earth, and finally they find this is an ice age, and we are in the newest uh, the new new uh, last age uh, already happened only 10,000 years. So the, the arguing between Bible creation, God creation and Big Bang is, for me, it's the same story. Big Bang, what does it mean Big Bang? They just say it's immediate bang and explosion and they create. Why? Nobody knows. How? Nobody knows. They just say it is really happening, Big Bang, and very short time, less than one second, everything was designed and created. How and why? As I mentioned, there's entropy. To make it such an organized way, random happening cannot be made. This is not the science. Science means there is some willing, some, some kind of a God or human or a science rules has to be ruled with some reason. That's what I'm thinking, the, the God. Uh, I believe there is a, some plans, there is a willings, who has really loved the universe, who really carrying the earth, who is carrying the humans after they, they are expecting something very nice. He gave everything free. We have to use this one to, for together to enjoy and to appreciate. So now we are talking about quantum communication. The, so far everybody believes there is no way to drive faster than the light. But how, how come the quantum communication is exist? There is a existence. They verify it's, it really exists. We don't know why, but we can use this one for computer technology, communication technology, which is definitely much faster, not two times, but infinite times or faster than light. So we have no time delay between any uh, location from in the universe, even if it has a 600 million years distance, it immediately happened. This is quantum entangled phenomena between two photons. So uh, we, we are living something very strange world and even we don't know why. Even Newton said the reason why the apple tree falling the apples on the ground, they said the reason, the question was why this happened. The Newton said this is the reason because of the universal law. But he doesn't describe why but still, he just describes how it works. So we can estimate the velocity when he falling down, but we don't know why. Still, the, this is question. It's like a quantum communication. It's like the what the light is. This is a miracle. So the the uh, knowledge we have is very limited, and I am I'm just watching how big size of the the solar sun and Earth. Very small planet here, which is just uh, maybe. Um, hundred times uh, smaller, small things. But on this planet surface, we are living. The, this, this surface is like an egg. The surface is only a territory. I mean, the surface of the Earth. Soil is here, but all the, the mental is a rigid part. It's kind of egg. But we are living on this surface. The temperature in the center is more than 6,000 degrees. The temperature of the sun Unbelievably, this is uh, uh, 15 million degree. Imagine how we control surface like a plus minus 50 degree. This is a very accurate temperature to keep human being on this planet. It's not the nature. This is a really randomly never can happen. This is something planned. That's why I'm thinking the God. I don't know the God is really like a Bible story. I don't know how it works, but. I just believe there is a super power who is really scientifically organized and loved the earth. 
And、uh, when I was a military research engineer, I, I make a stabilized gunfire control. Everybody knows I'm I'm working some part, and we make one of the best gunfiring stabilizer system. It is actually I I was the team leader for this. And then surprisingly, we、uh, I research、uh, the idea from human eye. When they have an arrow aiming on the horse, when the horse is riding with a very shaking. Shaking his、uh, back, a human still moving his、uh, head, but still still aiming. If you look at the eyeball, surprisingly, when he、uh, shake, eye stay on the、uh, initial coordinate. I mean, they they stabilized. The body is rotating, but eyeball is staying there, so there's no vibration. Otherwise, he will feel very serious headache. I found such a gyroscopic stabilizer mechanism is working on human body. Much advanced than the human tank. The stabilized tank came out only 1960 or 70 time, but 2,000 years, 4,000 years ago, 6,000 years ago, already every animal, every human has that kind of mechanism. Who has stabilized? The the some scientific, the the willings making this way so people can walk and the animal can run without any shaking of his paw. How come this happened? This is、uh, looks like、uh, something random, but this cannot be random. When you when you、uh, have a thousand of、uh, some rice and、uh, meals, and if you mix this one, it never come back after you fry. You have to divide by the human. There is a willing to make entropy zero state. The same thing. This is a perfect entropy, stabilized and well organized. It cannot be randomly created by Big Bang. This is what scientists say that entropy cannot be made by random. So if you look at all the natures, food, everything around us, there is enough oxygen, so we never worry about amount of oxygen. We have enough waters, which we never worry about the、uh, drinkings. There are a lot of、uh, the minings of. The steels,、uh, aluminiums, which is、uh, uh, we still thinking we、uh, ne- never seriously worry about the amount of steels made on covered on this planet. But the、uh, diamond, for example, lithium is not actually huge. We we know this is a limited material we are we are sharing, and also we believe even we spend all of this, we will have alternative one. How come everybody is so comfortable about this? Because we believe something, I I would say this is a God. I would say this is not the cannot be the same as Bible God, but、uh, maybe similar one. But I want to、uh, learn the basic heart from from the Bibles. Very important thing is God love us. This is what Christians、uh, point of view. Any anyway, all the natures, beauties, all the.、Uh, Uh, the around animals. How come such a beautiful animals around us? Of course, there's a mosquito, whatever. But everything looks very interesting for me, and a lot of fishes. The taste, everything so wonderful living on this planet. That's why I'm very appreciate my my birth, and also I wants to live long to share this. So when I see、uh, now b- during past several decades, we have a.、Uh, Too many changes from small things to now. Now the the world we have is unbelievable. We the scientists, I mean the physicists, the most advanced people is talking about time machine, which is crazy story. How come people are talking about time machine? And every、uh, paper, every if you see the the YouTube, many、uh, scientists say, mathematically this should be true. We can make this. How can we save to energy to go this uh, next uh, time domain? U- universe is not anymore universe. The unique verse is multiverse. Any any time domain we can move. This is really hard to understand how they are talking. I'm the I'm not the physicist, but anyway, the story they are talking is very exciting for me. That the the dimension of living.、Uh, It looks like we are in the sum of the dream, and then the real, real world is another space, something like that. We are talking about artificial intelligence. We now believe human-made intelligence can be better than human intelligence, 
And we are talking about the stem cells and then DNA, all the generic things. Every this kind of touching area was not permitted by the humans. We think this is a God's world, but now we are already talking about this one as a natural science. As I mentioned, quantum, quantum communication, quantum transportation. Someday we can show here, someday we can show there. We have many stories about near-death story. And everything looks like science cannot prove everything. But anyway, science is not the find the reason, but science is the, the, the knowledge how to use that one. As I mentioned, the uh, apple falling theory is exist, but they still don't know why this falling happened. So every uh, uh, time, so far, several thousand years, maybe human uh, history, like uh, three uh, million years, we never thinking to go outside of the earth. Human jump, one meter jump, and they're falling down. Immediately everything is we st stick on the surface. But now of, uh, on this uh, November, the, 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 the spatial, the traveling, reusable thing is happening so people can go out and see. I don't know whether we can travel to other planet, but this is the, the first challenge to go people enjoying universe. We, the universe was, we never complained, but anyway, universe is uh, hide. We cannot go outside, very dangerous, dangerous, but we wish to see and then enjoy there. But it is more reasonably approaching. Why all this thing is happening now? This is a big message for me. I'm thinking that if human on this planet love each other, then the next step of power and happiness will come to us. It means the human now democratic way by some activities. Maybe the uh, biggest uh, contribution for human history is made by the Bibles and the made by the Jesus Christ. They, they govern the, uh, a lot of philosophy and a lot of people changing. Of course, there are many other things contribute, but in general, we think that kind of uh, the human planet change make also this kind of result. So we are now living on this first generation, I mean the revolution time. So the Bible said, the Genesis said, human has to create more peoples and govern the world. Now the humans on this planet, comparing to the number of population in Jesus Christ, at the time we have only 0.2 billion people. But now we have 7.5 billion. Huge number of people increase. The whole earth is covering. The scientists say the humans on this planet may grow up to 10 billion. So every year we have uh, uh, about 0.1 billion people coming, so I, I don't know the number, billion, whatever. But anyway, the increase per year is every, every 0.1 billion people is increasing. That means about 25 years later, we will have 10 mil billion people covering us, and they are fully connected by the smart world. Everybody shaking, everybody sharing, nobody hiding bad things. Eventually, everybody trying to be frank, be nice to other people, to get more love from there. This is just a assumption. That's why God in Bible said to Adam and Eve, they congratulate to them to use all the power of the universe to govern and manage everything is yours. And then when he have a Noah ark, when he has a flood, uh, after flood he said all the Noah's family that you have to make a many uh, human population and also they should have governed the universe. So uh, when I see the history change, uh, watching 6,000 years of happening, there is a human power here, the amount of human managing power we can draw. One horse power, we stay several horses is the maximum. And now we have a lot of things happening, the, the steam power, and then water power, atomic power, solar power, and the scientists say the solar, which is a, which is a free solar power, 
will have more than I'd say there is a 4,500 4, terawatt which will cover whole uh, the energy we need in this planet. So we don't need to use a fossil power use or oil, but everything from the solar and wind will cover, which is about we are expecting year 20 to 50. That's a quite interesting story. All this happening during my life this time. All the this kind of vertical lineup, increasement of human history, human power is actually happening. But most important for me, for my happiness, is you. I mean, good people, good friends. When I have a very nice house, when I have very, very nice environment, always I'm looking for partners, friends. That's why the friends I have here is very important. I want to have more love to you and also I want to contribute something to create your love from my side too. That's why I'm working very hard to give more happiness, to have more uh, interesting things to share together, to get your attention, to get your interest. So all my effort is to have more love, to be more happy. Even I have a beautiful land, beautiful things. The most important is friends here. That's what I am thinking to train myself to work more hard to get your love from this this planet i don't know how long i'm i'm going to stay here but anyway when i look at all the history in the bible history and the science i just thinking there is a superpower who has a rule if he violate automatically we will have suffered and definitely all the other neighbors will will not stay with with me for example so we should know the, the history direction and the change of time, the power of energy, power of the science will make a more transparent world and we have to, we have to think all the things around us is, is made by the Big Bang or God whatever which is free for use and we have to think this is for other people to share. That's what I am thinking on this birthday. I'm not the priest. I'm not something. But I just want thinking by myself. So I, I just sharing my idea on this. Today I just use this one, new M Studio, which is the recording device of your life, recording and and propagation your message to other people without any complicated processing. This is what I want to contribute for humans. I would say nobody make an automatic video creating presentation machine as like I'm doing now. But I believe everybody can do, but actually for now I think this is one of the way how we share uh, our information. That's why we need a machine where you can always try to put your message there. Thank you very much. Uh, I hope you understand my Korean accent English. This is what I can do my best. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for your uh, saying happy birthday to me. Bye.